It was over a century past when the Great Troubles began. Fiends roamed the lands to the north and west of El Terrell. Fields were despoiled, livestock slaughtered, homes were razed, and people were dragged off to terrible and unknowable fates. Terror gripped the hearts of all. The city's cavalry rode across the land, striking down fiends whenever they found them and suffering fearful losses. But it was never enough. For every fiend they destroyed, it seemed as if two more appeared elsewhere. The ruler of El Terrell, the High Rider, asked his people to pray to the gods for aid. To everyone's astonishment, a mighty angel appeared and entered the city the next day. Her name was Zeriel, which means the Companion of Light. The prayers of El Terrell had been heard and help had come. Zeriel located a gate through which the fiends were entering the natural world. It was on the fields of dread to the west of the city. Zeriel declared that she would lead a cavalry into Avernus, destroying the infernal host that was amassing there, and striking a great blow against the forces of darkness. The High Rider set out the Riders of Elturel, now numbering many thousands with Zeriel at its head. She was riding a golden mastodon. With a great cry, Zeriel and her army charged through the gate. The legions of Avernus trembled and buckled, but they did not crumble. Zeriel was defeated, and the remnants of her army returned to Elturel, overcome with grief at the loss of their glorious general, but confident that the lords of the Nine Hell would now think twice about threatening Elturel ever again. There was great celebration to honor the valiant knights of the cavalry who had become known as the Hell Riders from that day on.